today I've got a total of actually three box and one unbox. These two are two $30 mystery boxes, comic book mystery boxes from the company Spider-Man Booth. Or that Spider-Man Booth. So these can contain some pretty nice comics. You get a total of like six, five, six comics in, in, in each box for 30 bucks shipped out the door. Fantastic deal. But also I'm unboxing on camera um, the most expensive comic I've ever owned. I've ever opened up. I probably have, well not touched, but uh, I've owned in my possession. And honestly, I'm just unboxing this thing on camera just for any kind of... For any reasons, I need any kind of, you know, PayPal credit card claim if this does not go right. But I purchased this for quite a bit of money, and I just want to capture this on camera from beginning to end. Boxed is still sealed. I don't want to show the person's address who I actually bought it from. There we go. Box is still sealed. Yeah, whenever, if you're a comic book kind of person and like you see this, you'll know how big this is and probably how much I had to pay for this comic. And I just want to capture this on camera, opening the actual box. There's that one. I'm going to actually go ahead, open up both sides just to show. It's still the original seal on this box. Opened up. Here's the comic. Just stuffing that the uh, the seller used, and it is nicely more stuffing. It is nicely bubble wrapped. Can't wait to see this. This is like this was on my bucket list of one of the one of the comics I I wanted to own very very badly, but I had to wait for the right price to come up. And I wanted it in a very, very high grade. This is CGC graded. And it is it is a very high grade for this comic. A lot of bubble wrap. And there we go. You see that? It's perfect. Yep. Hulk number 181 graded 9.0 white pages. The first full appearance of Wolverine. So, yeah. So, if you're a comic person, if you know this comic, if you know a uh, value of a 9.0 white pages, yeah. That kind of tells you how much I had to pay for, for this comic. I just wanted to protect myself on camera, opening up the box from start to finish, just in case. There was way too much money involved in this comic. But, uh... Yeah, one of the reasons why I, I wanted to buy this comic for many years now is because there's rumor of a Hulk versus Wolverine movie that's coming or might be getting made here in the future, possibly. And if that happens, this will go up even more in value. But yeah, this thing is a beautiful copy. Beautiful copy. Hulk 181 9.0 white pages CGC graded. That is awesome. Can't believe I actually own that comic now. So here we go. Here we go with the mystery box portion of this video. The actual portion that uh, you all came for. But the first box was just, like I said, just to protect myself as the buyer. You know, always, if you're buying and selling expensive items, protect yourself any way you possibly can, just in case. You know what I'm saying? It, it never hurts. It never hurts anything. Here we go. Mystery box. That Spider-Man booth. I feel like Peter, like a Peter Parker. First one. Okay, nothing on top's bubble wrap, so there's probably not any kind of huge hit in this then. If the top one is bubble wrapped, it's, it's going to be a pretty big hit, but here we go. There's a total of one, two, three, four, five comics in this box. First one. Some that will actually have kind of the value in the corner. Oh, cool. We've got Captain Marvel worth about 20 bucks. This is a, a cover variant, it looks like. 20 bucks right there. 
Next, oh nice. We got Deceased number one, worth about 15 bucks. Cool with Harley Quinn on the cover. Nice. That is cool. Deceased number one of six. Next one. We got Secret Wars Marvel 002. I don't know anything about this comic. There's that one. Next one. We got... Yes, the Batman Who Laughs, number two. Nice. That's a good comic right there. 15 bucks, Batman Who Laughs, number two. I'm actually, I'm looking for the Batman Who Laughs, number one, in like a 9.0, or 9.0, 9.8 CGC graded. Uh, if, you, if you had the Batman Who Laughs, number one, 9.8 CGC hit me up. I am, I, I am a buyer for it. And last one in this in this box, we have New Warriors. I, don't, I do not know much about this one. New Warriors number zero zero three. So the top hits in this box are these three right here. All these I got for thirty bucks shipped. These three here are some three very very nice hits. Favorite one on this box is actually probably going to be the deceased number one variant cover. So nice box for thirty bucks. You can't you can't beat that. It's a nice box. So here we go, box number two, mystery box. Once again, like six more or five more comics. Here we go. Okay, nothing on top is bubble wrapped, so there's probably no huge huge hit then. Here we go. First comic. This has a total of five in it. First one. What do we get? Oh, cool. We got a Venom. We got a variant cover of a Venom. I don't know which issue this is, but it is valued at about 25 bucks for a Venom variant cover. Very cool. Next one. The Flash, number one. Now, this is from September 2017. Flash, number one, Justice League Essentials, DC Universe Rebirth. So that's a nice comic right there. I'll take it. Next one, number three. We've got She-Hulk and Captain Marvel, Earth's Mightiest Heroes, The Avengers. I have never seen this comic before. I'm not sure if it's a variant cover or what exactly. But you got She-Hulk and Captain Marvel. I've been kind of curious of when they plan to introduce She-Hulk into the Marvel Cinematic Universe. I'm sure that uh, She-Hulk will probably be appearing, you know, in one of the next few phases, I bet. I could be totally off on that, but I'm sure that She-Hulk will be appearing in, in the MCU probably sooner than later. But yeah, here we go. Comic number four. What we get? Oh, cool. Spider-Man Adventures number four. This is from... I don't see a date on it. It's a buck fifty, so it's a little bit older one. You know, not an older, but maybe like a few years, a few years ago. But this is the Fox Kids Network Marvel Comics. I don't really know... I don't know. But Spider-Man Adventures at number four. That's a cool one. And the last one. This one's actually the thickest one. Last one, number five. Who did we get? Oh, cool. We got Peter Parker, the, spectic the Spectacular Spider-Man. Number 300 Variant Edition. Oh, that's cool. Vera, we got Venom on there, Carnage. Nice. That's actually a really cool cover. Look, look at the art on that cover. Sometimes just the art alone on a cover like makes the comic. Very cool. So this one, this is telling me that there's about, you know, these three are my three bigger hits at 25, 15, and 15. But yeah, all five of these for only 30 bucks shipped. 
that's a fantastic deal. And uh, so that's what we got from the two $30 that Spider-Man booth mystery boxes. Favorite comic out of all five actually is the deceased number one. Actually, I was looking to actually purchase one of those. So I got one, so I don't actually don't have to buy one now. But yeah, that's what we got. And of course, I got the big daddy of them all. Hulk 181, CGC graded 9.0 white pages. A very, very key comic that everybody needs to own. It doesn't matter if, if it's a raw grade, low grade, high grade. Everybody needs to own this comic in your collection if you like comics. So, yeah, that's what we got. I'll see you next time, and I'm out.